We are going to be playing a game that might be the best state roleplay game of all time of 2023, maybe ever. So the game that we're going to be playing today is Connecticut State Roleplay. So this game has everything you could want of a roleplay game. Amazing, amazing graphics, cars, players, staff team, whatever you could say, they would have it. So we're just going to be reviewing the game with the teams. So how about we get straight into the game? Let's go. Alrighty, so as soon as you get into the game, there is a menu or a little loading screen that you can click uh, to uh, get it off your screen. But as you can see, we have a flashlight and a surrender to make role plays even better. At the top of the screen, it shows your money, uh, which direction you're looking into, and um, the current time of the game. It is not army times. It used to be. Maybe they'll put it back. I do not know. But in the bottom right, and in the bot in the top right, it says the MDT, but that is only for ranked people, so you would have to do trainings through the Discord. So in the bottom right, it says menu, and when you click on it, you have some four options. You have the store, which has the donation pass, MDC pass, security pass. There is no refunds, and uh, the gun pass, which is all pretty cool. Next up, you have the jobs. So you have the police teams, the fire teams, uh, the DOT team. Uh, EMS, truck driver, news reporters, CVS worker, Cum uh, Cumberland Farms worker, and then the Game Pass teams, the security and MDC, and then the ranked teams, which is SRT, so all pretty cool. Next up, we have the rules. No fail roleplay, no exploiting, no random deathmatch, no rank uh, impersonation, and no and also have fun. Next up is the settings. You can choose for shadows, uh, bloom high, and your fog. Let me do something real quickly. Just give me one second. Sorry about that. I was sweating like crazy. So how about we get uh, straight into the map area. And also spawn car. You have all of these cars. Including donation pass and civilian. I believe a video that came out a couple days ago. I went over every single car for civilian. Except for donation pass. So how about we just go with the BMW X5. Also this game does not. And you also can uh, select your color. Also, this game goes very serious about not uh, driving like a lunatic. You gotta like drive 30-ish. Uh, Don't be driving like 150, crashing, resetting your car, uh, just to make the game a lot more fun. So this game is really uh, well made. I play this game a lot and make a lot of videos on it. I just oh, never mind. It might be army time. I do not know. Maybe, maybe it is, maybe it isn't. So as you can see, we have a little CVS over there. Looks like uh, a DQ and a another cleaning little store. This guy is not allowed to make that turn. Oh, shoot. Is that... Shoot. Shoot, I'm getting out of here. That guy has his gun out. Oh, no. I am not in the mood to do that this video. I think he's coming after me. So there is a bank and a gun store. I think this guy's going to come shoot me. He's just coming to pass me. Very rude. So there's a bunch of little roads here. And I love how to... I know I'm saying it a lot. You also have... Uh, you can choose to have it in miles per hour, uh, kilometers, and SPS. So all different, but all pretty cool. I don't know what this guy's trying to achieve here. Like, I know you're trying to kill me. Don't, don't make it that obvious. So, as uh, coming up, there is a lot to see. So, you can already see there's a bunch of houses. Um, this is a huge road, by the way. Uh, there's also a bridge. And over there, there are a lot more houses. Looks like there's a crime scene going on. Maybe somebody's getting arrested or something. So, this big building over here is your police station. Oh, pretty cool as well. And there's some extra stores and also... Right here, you might be wondering what this is. You come in here and it's a huge movie theater so you and your friends can enjoy a good show. It is the same show that's been going on for about like a year or two. 
it's weird. So coming over here, uh, if you turn right over here, you have the fire department. This is the fire department one. There is a two or uh, three, so, but that kind of wraps up for that. So now we're going to be checking out some of the teams. The first team that we'll be checking out is, let's just do the main team, which is Winchester Police. So the game is um, off of Winstead and Winchester uh, they might be the same place, I do not know, but all pretty cool. So, as soon as you get into the game or t on the team, in the top left, it says call sign randomizer. You want to press confirm, and you have all of this cool stuff, which is your dispatch. It shows whoever else is on the team. You have this menu with, uh, with your accessories, your uniform. Then you have your vest with the belt and vest. And then you have your headdress. Some teams might have it. In your loadout, the ranked tools, the tools, and the guns. We're just going to do guns. Uh, ranked tools is for ranked people only. So you have five different guns, or never mind, six different guns to choose from. Normally, if you're in roleplay terms, you should really only be using the Glock. Um, there's like a little Easter egg board with the wanted people. Those are the owners and the lead developer, I believe. So I do not know what's going on here. Let's just get out of here. Already, so you could have a uh, gallon out from the back as well. Not these people again. They're gonna come kill me. Okay, I'm gonna. What are these guys doing? I swear to God, if they come out and shoot me, I'm gonna get mad. So. As you can see, there's a lot of stuff to see. So the locked cars are the ranked cars. The game pass is donation pass, and the donation game pass is also is also the uh, donation pass, but just on marked. So how about we just go with the charger marked? I also want to drive away a little bit, so I'm not. I believe there's like a huge thing going on. I'll show this car after we get away from everybody. But over here, there's a just a pretty big neighborhood. So how about we just go right here? So as you can see, looking at the car, it says Town of uh, Winchester Police with the uh, Winchester uh, little uh, logo. I believe they're getting a redo of some of these cars, which is also pretty cool. Here are the lights. So pretty cool as well. This is such a beautiful car. Um, it's one of, I believe it's one of my favorites in the game. Not every car I like, but here are the sirens. So pretty cool again. In the bottom, there's also a radar and your spotlight. All pretty cool. Here's it from a little backed up view. Pretty cool as well. So how about we do one more car and then let's switch to the fire department team. Let's do the explore. So as you can see, it's the same livery, but just some different things that you can notice. So pretty cool as well. All these cars are super cool. So how about we go on to the next team, which is Fire Department 1. So let's go there now. Let's go. Alrighty, so as soon as you get into the team, you can see that you spawn here as well. So the locker system is the same as PD, so as you can see, but it's just in a different color. So your uniform, you can have bun a bunker or a station. I prefer bunker. Then accessories, you can have your uh, radio. Uh, radio, you can have radio full, side, or front. Then you have your vest. The SBA is normally the best for this. And then your headdress, your helmet. And your loadout, you have your tools, so all pretty cool. A huge menu with a lot of cool stuff. So now, uh, so you have a attack hose, water, traffic, barrier, pa uh, pike pole, cutter, jaws of life, generator, backboard, halligans, and all this. And also in your other inventory, you have your cones, the K-12, the rake, and the attack hose foam. Foam is used for chemical and water is just used for um, maybe wood or something. I do not know, but so you have all these. The locked is the rank stuff. You do have to rank and do trainings with the FTOs that would be found in the Discord. Um, and then the top, so the squad five, that's the one we'll be checking out. So as you can see, it says squad five Winstead with the Winstead logo. You can open these compartments up and it has your some of your um, stuff that you'll be using. In the back, you can also open this up, which has your uh, generator. 
and these are the same exact things all pretty cool this is where you'll connect your water and inside you have a bunch oh, let me get in on the inside you have a bunch of seats and here are the lights and sirens So pretty cool again, so how about we go on to the final team that we'll be checking out. And actually, we'll do one more fun team, but uh, which is the EMS team. My leg is very itchy. I don't know why. It just hurts so much. So on the EMS team, you, uh, you will spawn at this little place. This is not the hospital. The hospital, you just have to go down this road for like a while and then go up another road and you'll be there. So, um... This is where the house uh, for um, what am I saying? Where one of the ambulances will park. So you have a jump bag, your stretcher. The stretcher is currently broken. The life pack 12, the alert and just scope, and more will be coming soon. So, um, you have your rank stuff and you have your normal stuff that you can do. So let's just go with the uh, Ford F450 ambulance. So as you can see, it says Winston Volunteer Ambulance with the yellow and the blue and white. Pretty nice on the inside. The steering wheel actually moves and you have two seats. Coming into the back, you can see we have our stretcher and stuff you would be using uh, when um, bringing your um, patient into the hospital. You have the lights and the sirens. Oh my goodness, what's going on? I do not know what's happening, but I think he just got shot. So pretty cool again. So how about we go on to the next team? Watch we do two more, which is the uh, Department of Transportation. Alrighty, so on the team, you have all of these things that you'll be using, like your signs, your cones. Uh, traffic cones, broom, and is there more in here? Yes, uh, large traffic cones. This is the station that you'll spawn at. This is used to park uh, your stuff that you'll have. So on here, you have your Connecticut dot and your Win uh, uh, Winchester. There is also a Game Pass tow truck. So the Connecticut dot and this will just go with the 22 F350. So it is a orange, and it says Winchester Street Department. And uh, you have a little light on here. So pretty nice again. So that is pretty cool. On to the final team, which is a fun team. Uh, there's not much really to do on here, but we'll just do it. Uh, the Cumberland Farms Worker. So this is uh, just a team that you can just go on. Um, so you can... Also, another cool feature about this game. So you can uh, rob... Like, you can rob the bank and rob the cash reg uh, registers. Um, I can't do it right now. Maybe it doesn't work. But we have this cool uniform. This is the uh, the restroom. And in the back, this is, like, just uh, some extra little rooms for staff. So, um, out of... And these are actually two real uh, places. Like, real places are being used. So, that is going to wrap it up for... And that over there is also the hospital. So, that is going to wrap it up for today's video on playing Connecticut State Roleplay. So, this is one of my favorite roleplay games. And I'm not being biased. I actually give it a 10 out of 10. Amazing game to play. I definitely recommend it to you guys. So, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And goodbye. See you.